Hi! It is already time for March favorites. Again, went by fast, but let's get going on this and I will show you the things that I have been loving using and going crazy with all month. Some of these things um, I've only brought out a couple times of the month, but I'll explain why and I still love them so they're still making the favorite favorites. So anyway, let's jump right in. Okay, first of all, this is something very new to me. Um, I wanted to give it a try, decide what I thought of it, and it's by New Face. It's by Carol Cole. It's New Face. And it's the Prep and Glow Cleanse, Exfoliate, and Hydrate. It's dual sided. So these little deals, they come in a box of 20, and they are individually packaged, so they're perfect for travel. So you've got this lovely little pouch, you open it up, and it is a little pre moistened sheet. Now one side is smooth and the other side has these little tiny little micro dots. I can't imagine that you can see that from here, but we're going to try. <laughs> so first off, you remove all your makeup with the smooth side and it really works well. I mean, quickly, it's amazing and it's nothing's left. Then you turn it over and you have the scrubby side with the little, um, the little nubs and it's no joke. I mean, it exfoliates like crazy so be careful if your face is sensitive with the first time you use it maybe you only want to use it once or twice a week others it can be used daily there you have it um, I have been using mine daily just to see what it does and see if it does irritate me at all and it does not irritate me one bit I love it it removes so much makeup and I love how it exfoliates it's oil paraben and alcohol free which is really good and the best part is it is infused with hyaluronic acid so you've got that lovely plumping effect exfoliation all your makeup off perfect so perfect for travel like I said they come 20 in a box they are definitely more expensive than your average drugstore makeup wipes, but they do more. Um, so they come out to about a dollar, a dollar a wipe. So that would be a dollar a day to keep your face exfoliated, hyaluronic acid on it, and cleansed beautifully. So that's uh, one of the things that I have been loving all month. Now, normally, before I ever tried those, for years I've been using these Peter Thomas Roth um, Unwrinkle Peel Pads. I highly recommend these. These are so, so good. It's just one of those little, you know, round pre-moistened pads that you use all over your face. Um, this is kind of a jumbo. It's 90 pads in this once a day. You can use it less again if you're sensitive, but it's 20% complex alpha, beta, gamma, exfoliators and amino acids. The building blocks of peptides exfoliates, resurfaces, clarifies, firms, helps visibly minimize pores, fine lines, uneven skin tone, has vitamins A, C, D, E, and F, has chamomile, green tea extracts, fragrance-free, alcohol-free, soft pillow pads for all skin types. I love them. I've used them so many years um, since they started, I believe, since they first came out. I've been using these and I rarely talk about them because it's just sort of part of my normal life. I don't even stop to think to do so. But as I was planning to talk about those and I remember the exfoliating, I wanted to share these too. And I have an extra jumbo 90 pack brand new to give to one of you. So this will be in a giveaway. So check the information down below how to enter that. And you might be the one that receives a 90 pack of these and give them a try. They're really, really good. Had to mention those too. I put this back in the container, but I have been using this. You'll see it might be a little dirty. I did clean it beforehand, but this is the one I have been using and it is a, a Real Techniques um, foundation blender. Now this is kind of like a kabuki brush, but shaped differently. I love a good kabuki type of a, of a brush and I love Real Techniques. So I thought I'd give this one a try and I'm really enjoying it. I didn't know what the shape would be like. So, um, let me see, it's a little, yeah, there's some makeup in there. <laughs> um, it's so soft, densely, densely packed bristles. Um, holding it is joy. I mean, I just kind of hold it like this in my hand and you can get real, you know, you know, top to bottom. What is that? Not horizontal. Um, vertical. <laughs> I heard it hold it vertically for the most part. You can get re you really can get in the different crevices and stuff around your eyes. You can pat things on, you can get under the eye. Um, it's just really good for overall blending. It does a beautiful, beautiful job. I'm really enjoying this. So if you happen to see one of these out and about and you're thinking, Hmm, what's it like? It's, it is absolutely amazing. The quality is unbelievable. Uh, it's not expensive at all. Highly recommend these really enjoying that. The lip I'm wearing today, I've been wearing a lot this past month, and it is the NARS, uh, what is it called, Velvet Glide Lip Color in Roseland, and I'm just so much enjoying this.
And Velvet Glide is a great name for it. It feels so good when you put it on. It stays put. And I just think it's a beautiful color. I really, really like this one. More lips. I have been enjoying the Fresh brand Sugar Lips in the different um, scents for so long. And now they have Mint, which is so, so perfect. It's a lip treatment. It just glides right on beautifully. It lasts very, very long, very moisturizing wonderful and then you have that lovely mint smell it's almost like a breath mint for your lips um it just this is what it looks like in the tube so so good i have one of these in my purse i carry with me everywhere i go and i enjoy it so much another makeup item i swear it's not all makeup um another makeup item i have been trying i'm wearing it today and i really enjoy it i don't know what took me so long to try this one but it is the chanel corrector concealer and I'm loving it. I have mine in uh, number 20, which is beige, beige 20. And it is a beautiful color. It works well, it covers well, it doesn't look cakey. Um, I can't say enough about it and I do not know what took me so long to try it, but loving that very, very much. Then the foundation I have on my face, I have been wearing uh, seriously nonstop since I got it. So it's been over a month and I love it. I'm getting to the end of it though. It's, it's, getting, it's getting low, I need a new one. But I love it. It is the Lancome, can't pronounce this, let's see. How am I gonna do this? It's the Lancome, I'll put it right here. <laughs> Ultra Long Wear Foundation Stick and I love that it's SPF 21, perfect. I have mine in Buff Neutral. It's like an eraser stick for my face. I found the exact same color as my skin. So before I have it on, everything just looks a little more blotchy. I've got a lot of um, pigmentation and freckles and a few little spots and marks and things. But to go over my face with this stick, it's like the exact same color as my skin, but then all the imperfections have blurred out and it's just wonderful. I just really do enjoy this very much. Obviously, I'm almost out. Um, and I definitely need to get another one. And because <clears throat> I'll be getting some sun in, in, in the next few weeks, I'll be away on vacation. I want to grab one a little darker too, because I think this will be too light once that happens. And that might look odd. So I'm definitely grabbing another one. I love that it has SPF 21. I absolutely love that it doesn't feel like anything on your face. You still look like you're wearing, you know, you're wearing skin. You still look like you're wearing skin. It looks like your skin still. Um, it doesn't look like a mask, but it beautifies. I just love it. I just, this is really, really great. So I wanted to definitely mention that this time. Okay, I have a few luxury items I'm gonna talk about here in a minute, but first I have an electronic kind of a thing. Um, all right, for my upcoming trip, I am going to be um, flying in the air for 13 hours. And I knew that I needed a lot of things to entertain myself with. I'm going to try to sleep for some of it, but I can never sleep on a plane. I don't, I can't even sleep in first class laying down flat with a comforter and a pillow on a plane. I cannot, I just can't sleep. So I knew that wasn't gonna happen much. So I'm trying to think, well, what can I download? What books can I bring? What can I have with me so that I'm entertained? And so I was looking for apps on my iPad. And I found two that I love so much, I can't stop playing them now. I wanna make sure I have you know, more to do when I'm on the plane, but I love them. Okay, so here's the thing. The two that I'm loving the most, let me find them for you. But the first one is called Pixel Art. I'll show you the little icon. Um, I have it on my phone and I also have it on my iPads and I don't know where else it's available to get it, you know, on what other platforms, but I absolutely am addicted to this. Okay, let me just show you what it, it does. So here's your pixelated picture. You have your different colors down here. Um, we're gonna start with the color number, let's turn the brighter one, number five. It highlights where that five is and then you just, you just make it bigger. So where you see the fives and you can just color it in that color. Okay, it is so satisfying. It's like therapy. I don't even know what, but it is so satisfying. And then you go to the next color and it highlights where those are. So then you color that one in, oops. You know, you can either dot, you can either dot, you dot, 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 or you can just swipe your stylus across to fill, in, fill it in in the big long line. I'm telling you, it's addictive. It's absolutely therapeutic. I don't know, I love it. I absolutely love it, so I wanted to share it with you. Ooh, I kicked you. So I wanted to share it with you because this is so, so cool. And I've done quite a few, and I need to you know, make sure I still have some to do on the trip, but that's number one, my favorite. Now, the other one I really, really like is called Artbook, and I'll show you what the icon for that one looks like here too. So basically, 
you've got your different choices of the different things you can choose to color. Sorry about the glare of my little ring light. So I've already done all of these. <laughs> I need to stop so that I, but I have plenty to do on the trip so lots and lots to choose from um, let's try let's start one for example this is the one we're going to do all right so same premise <laughs> you click on the color and it has highlighted the areas that take that color so you just push click and it colors it in click click let's go to that color it's so satisfying i can't even tell you so anyway i love these i wanted to share them but here's the thing that makes it even better the stylus that i had to do this with you can use your finger but it's just sometimes some things are kind of intricate especially with the um pixel art because you just got little boxes you're dealing with um and i've <clears throat> you know i was getting outside the lines <laughs> so i wanted to make sure that i used a stylus so the stylus i had had a, like a rubbery tip on the end and it works but it kind of drags and i don't know that just wasn't as satisfying and i thought i wish this was smooth or I, you know so I was looking into smooth styluses styli whatever and I found this one and I bought two I have a silver one and a white one they come in many different colors and I love it it is a like a metal mesh tip and it's so smooth and just to be able in it oh it's perfect oh my gosh I can't even tell you it just makes it even a better experience <laughs> So if you think I'm absolutely crazy, I don't blame you. If you think this is something that could be right up your alley, yay, you're one of us. Um, but yeah, those two apps plus this type of a stylus, I can't even. It, uh, try it. Now on to um, three luxury items that I love. One is new, the other two aren't as new, but I have been loving them. First off, you might have seen these in a recent video that I did about some new things that I had purchased. These I could wear all over the place. I could wear them out to dinner. I love that it's a chunkier heel. It's a smaller heel. It's not so pointy and fantastic. Um, the sparkle is very light. I love the skin tone for me. Um, it kind of has more of a skin tone type of a flair to it. It just blends. Um, so it goes with just about anything. Adds just a little zazz at the foot. So, so comfortable. I'm loving these even though I've not worn them yet except for around the house. But I do know <laughs> that I love these. I got these flats last summer and they're the, the PVC. They're kind of the rubbery plasticky kind. They can go to the beach with you if you want them to. From the beach straight to the party. Um, so, so cute. I found uh, arch support inserts that are clear that I put down on these. I have a video about that and they just stick, kind of stick to it, but peel right off because this is plasticky and the other is too. Um, perfect without ruining anything. I love these, love them. And now that it's March, end of March, we've had a few days, it's gotten to the high 60s, you know, almost hitting, hitting 70 degrees. It's been warm enough that even with like jeans and a sweater, these are cute. So any chance I've gotten after I got my pedicure, I put these on. So I'm already loving them all over again this year. I had someone named Jennifer, hi, um, contact me asking me if there's, if these came with these extra studs and the um, bags, you know, the shoe bags that go with it. And mine did. I'll show you. Hers apparently didn't. She said that she got hers at Nordstrom. Here they are. From for these, you know, for these flats. It did come with them for me. She said she bought hers at Nordstrom and it did not. So if you buy it, and I got mine at Nordstrom and they did. So I think there must have been a mistake there. So if you, for any reason, do not get the um, the dust bags for the shoes and the extra studs when you buy these please make sure that you do get them because they are, they come with the same Valentino um, special stuff and packaging uh, that they should. Even though they are the PVC and they're a little less expensive not being leather, they still come with all of the things that they should. So I just want to let you know that too. So yeah. Again, I've mentioned this guy before too. This is so flipping useful. I just love it. I didn't think I would love it as much as I did do. I use it mostly for the most part for um, like little lippies and things that I've um, gotten. My chapsticks, I can't go anywhere without my chapsticks and my like Dior and a little um, one of these Mac Velvet Teddy kind of goes with everything. That's always goes with me everywhere I go. This is costume jewelry. The other one was actual diamonds this is not but it's been working really well it's not bothering my skin at all i think it's really cute it gives the same general idea and look and i'm really liking it. it's just kind of a little pave disc um really liking that so i wanted to mention that i've been wearing it a lot 
Also this top, I think it's still available. Um, it's either Ann Taylor or Loft. I'll see if I can find it, but I love it. It's just kind of a three quarter length sleeve. I don't know if you can see that there is um, kind of a, almost looks like an embroidered sort of a bit to it, even though it's not really embroidered, I don't know. But this is a navy. It just, it's just so comfortable. It's perfect for spring. It fits so well. I'm just loving it. So I wanted to mention that too. So yeah, thank you so much. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.